All right, so the driverless cars may not be so driverless after all. Uh, the New York, Times, New York Times came out with this article uh, where they profile a company called Zooks, which is owned by Amazon. And the service they provide is a couple of hundred uh, technicians who constantly monitor the video feeds coming out of these so-called driverless cars. And if they run into any issue, they kind of nudge them and guide the cars out. So and the issue is going to be something as challenging as the fire truck not being the right color. Now, from a computer vision point of view, I get it. I've worked in this field for over six years, so I, I get it. Um, but it's a larger problem, and that is outsourcing of the work. Uh, if you remember a few months ago, maybe a year ago, uh, Amazon had another scandal where it came out that their so-called self-checkout at their Whole Foods was actually manned by cheap paid workers in India. And as similar technologies of human in the loop expand, it's going to feed into the problem of imperialism, where these jobs will get cast out to the, the low-paid workers, and this is something we should